morning guys today is July 1st and we're headed to Palm Springs but first we're making our usual traditional stop at Red Hill coffee shop in Rancho Cucamonga here's Annie she's making her first trip to Palm Springs with us this is our third year going to Palm Springs for the 4th of July weekend and here's Red Hill coffee shop where we usually make our breakfast stop. I love what this. What is this poster made? 1998. <laughs> See, Titanic, 1997, that's the last one. Here's the front of our Palm Springs house and this is a rental. Of course we don't live here, we don't know the people who live here, nothing like that. We just rented this place and we're staying here with all of Jeff's family. So this is how it looks when you walk in, nice and modern. And it looks way better than the second house that we stayed in last year. So I'm just gonna show you around outside before it gets too hot. I haven't seen this part yet. I've been inside already, so I'm not gonna be surprised, but oh. So I'm assuming this will lead us to the backyard, which is really, really nice. Yeah. I love the way this house looks because the one we stayed in last uh, two years ago was really nice but it just felt like cluttered and old inside it didn't have the new modern look like this house has here's the kitchen we haven't unloaded all of the things yet here's the dining area the living room TV really nice don't you think here's the back room and here's where Roxana is staying Jeff's sister hey Annie Annie came to visit I don't know where the lights are so can't turn the lights on in here oh over here so this could be like a secondary house check it out okay so here's the room with the bed and the desk walk-in closet over here that looks really cool right But then you come over here and there's another little area, kind of like a study area, I guess. So they have a towel rack and then this door leads to the outside, although I can't open it. I don't have the key. But there's a little study area here with a desk, fridge. See what I mean? Like it can be your own little, I guess, guest house. Here's the bathroom. And this is this side of the house. This takes up one whole side. I like how the living room is in the middle. Living room and dining room. Over here is the bathroom. One bathroom. So the hole is kind of weird. And over here is the master bedroom. I love this little study room in the master bedroom. It's so cool. Master bathroom. Hey. I don't know where all these doors lead to. Wow, this looks awesome. There's so much seating. I like how it looks out. I love how the pool is dark. I'll take you out there in a minute. This is an awesome master bedroom. It even has a little fireplace. I don't know what, oh, here's a closet. Okay. So this is Grandma Angie's room. Here's our room. They give you so many blankets and pillows. That's really cool. And you can change the bed sheets too. Let's see. All these linens. This is where we're staying. Check it out, guys. This is so awesome. Lounging area. So much seating. There's so much seating out here.
the pool. I don't know how deep it is. A fire pit. So cool. It's awesome. An outdoor shower. Wow. Okay, so that's the entire Palm Springs house. I gotta go inside because I'm already getting really hot. I don't know how hot it is out here, but I'm starting to sweat already. I'm not used to this much heat, and it's kind of it's not that windy. I think two years ago when we came, it was a bit more windy. But I hope you enjoyed the tour of the house. I'm ready to celebrate the whole weekend, and I'll keep you updated on the whole trip. station right now and everyone's about to board we're boarding in 10 minutes so this is in our tram so the tram's gonna be taking us up here you see it coming down it's far off like right here I think you can stay up there for however long you want and come down whenever you want I'm assuming that's how it works but I'm not positive I think so though we made it. I'm so excited. It's so nice up here. I've been wanting to come up on the aerial tramway the past three times we've come to Palm Springs. And finally today we came up and we're checking out the view. Jeff's already down there somewhere. <laughs> but it looks really cool up here.
see, you can't see us right now, but Jeff and I are at Joshua Tree. We just took a drive up here. And I'm speaking kind of low because there's other groups. It's pitch black out here. You can see there's a car over here and a little thing. But look how I turn and there's nothing. And I can't pick out the stars on this camera, but Jeff and I are staring at the Milky Way right now. It's so awesome. This is something I've never experienced before. We have a towel you want to lay on the ground. This is like the best view I've ever had of the sky. I've never seen the Milky Way and we're looking right at it. If you guys want to come see it at home, all you have to do is just look at the map and figure out when there's no moon and then come on out. Yeah, there's no, it's technically the, what they call the new moon, which is when there's no moon outside. Um, so yeah, we just drove up here. It took us a while. And oh, you saw that? Uh-uh. Did you see a shooting star? No. Okay, we're going to go and enjoy this time, but definitely come out, um, come out here you have to come jeff and i just got back from palm springs we left this morning kind of late morning instead of leaving tomorrow july 5th because we had a small emergency that we had to take care of and we were trying to take care of it in palm springs but it just wasn't going to work out so we came home to take care of that we're here now everything's taken care of we're all good and we're just relaxing now. Jeff's actually sleeping because he's not feeling too well. Jeff's family is still in Palm Springs. They're coming home tomorrow, which is when we all were supposed to come home. So I don't know what we're going to do tonight, if anything, to celebrate. But I'm glad we at least got to spend the weekend in Palm Springs and have a good time with the family, just relaxing, having fun. So... With that, I'm going to leave you here. I hope you all have a very happy and safe 4th of July. 4th of July is my favorite holiday, by the way. But anyway, I hope you all have a happy and safe 4th of July. And I'll see you in my next video. Bye!